Hi, I'm Dr. Darren Stigall. Welcome to another express exercise video. In this one, we're going to cover uh, strengthening your lower back and your abdominal muscles, which in effect is strengthening your core. This is very critical to help not only reduce lower back pain, but reduce the chance that your lower back will flare up on you or worse yet, go out on you. And if you've had that happen, then you're of course motivated to do these exercises to prevent that. If you get lost or you want, you just need a handout to help you go step by step, submit your email to us through direct uh, messaging or put it on a comment below and we will get you the handout into your inbox so that you can just follow it step by step. So let's begin by getting on our hands and knees. You would of course be on the floor at home. If you need to be in the bed, that's okay. We're gonna begin by raising opposite arm, opposite leg. Here it is, opposite arm, opposite leg. Look at a point out in front of you. It makes it much easier to do this exercise than if you're looking down. If you're looking at the point out in front of you, do 10 times per side. If you're a little stronger, go for 20 times per side. Do not overdo it. Just go until you feel a little bit of fatigue and pick a nice round number to do. I'm going to go for 10 on each side or 15 on each side or 20 on each side. You do not have to try to accomplish too much in one shot. This is a marathon, not a sprint. Don't overdo it or you'll be too sore and you won't want to do it anymore. Now we're going to go down to the plank. This is our second one. We're in a plank. As your pelvis starts to drop down and you fatigue, bring it up. After you do that a couple of times, you are done. You're plenty good on that. If you can do it 10 seconds at the beginning, don't sweat it. It's perfect. That's where you're at in life, and that's okay. If you can do 30 seconds, great. Try to work your way up to a minute over time. Now we move to our third exercise. We're going to go to planks. We're on our back. Knees are bent. Pelvis comes up, up. 10 in a row, if it's super easy, maybe go for 20. Again, this is the long haul that we improve our core and our spine and our body. This is not something we accomplish overnight, so do not expect it to happen overnight. So we've done 10, 15, maybe 20 of those. Let's move to the next one. It's simple crunches to isolate or, or to, um, to pinpoint our abdominal muscles or our stomach. You always execute the movement from your abs. You do not pull on your head. I'm simply cradling my head with my hands. Or you could even just put your hands here if you want to. That is all you have to do. We're going to go to the last one now. Here it is. Knees are up. This is getting a little bit more advanced. Knees stay close to you. It's easier. Knees go further away. It gets tougher. If it's too much strain on your lower back, Place your hands under your rear end to tilt your pelvis up a little bit and it will give you support. Either way, we're going to go about 8 to 10 inches side to side. Take your knees out further, it's going to be a little bit tougher. If you need to give yourself support, put your hands here and go side to side. If you just cannot do this yet and it's too much strain on the lower back or you just want an alternate, lower your legs down one foot on top of the other and just do the same crunches we were doing simply do them with your knees to the side like this that's all you have to do so we've done all five of the exercises and that is a great simple quick express core workout do it daily do it at least four days a week but do it daily if you can. If you have pain and you need to stop and ask us about it or ask your physical therapist or your, your chiropractor about it, that is fine. You don't want to do damage on accident, so make sure that you're not doing anything that you're not quite ready to do. Other than that, it should help. Core strengthening is very important. It's the most important part of any strengthening exercises you're going to do for the body. I hope this helps. Dr. D, over and out.